Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing good today. So today in this video, I am going to talk about five lipstick that are similar to one another that might be a dupe of one another in shades. So I'm going to be talking about the same shade of lipsticks that I have in my collection. So it's going to be a really short video. It's not going to be long. Uh, in this video, I am just going to show you guys the lipsticks that I have currently found that are very similar to one another and show you guys the swatches on my lips as well. So yeah, that's it for today's uh, video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you guys think that I should do this at least once a month so that you guys don't end up buying the same lip lipstick shades and save your money. So let's get into the video now. Also, if you are someone who's new to my channel, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you like the vibe i hope you like the content if you end up liking the content you can hit the subscribe button along with that the notification bell as well so let's get into the video now okay for the first tube we have the plum liquid lipstick and as you can see this is a peachy toned lipstick and the next lipstick we have here that is similar to the plum is the glam girls one the glam girls only retail for 105 rupees i think so so you can see there is quite a bit of price difference and as you can see look at the shade it's exactly similar you guys like like both are peachy toned nude lipstick and I absolutely love the formula of both the lipsticks actually. They are exactly same. Not just the shade but even the formula is very very similar. So if you have the plum one you obviously don't have to get the glam girls one but if you do not have the plum one and you want this lipstick you can save some of your money and buy the glam girls one maybe because I feel like look at the shade it's exactly similar so yeah i absolutely love both the lipstick i was just going through my collection yesterday when i saw both these lipsticks and i was like oh my god this is an exact dupe of one another and i need to show you guys if you love peachy toned nude lipstick i feel like you're going to love this this actually washes me out if i wear this alone but if i wear this with a brown lip liner it looks so flattering on my skin tone so whenever you're wearing a peachy nude lipstick if you wear this with a brown nude lip liner it's going to look amazing so anyway this was my first dupe let's move into the second one so for second one again the tones are very similar i know so this is the inside matte lip ink and this is the studio west liquid lipstick i love both the lipstick actually the formula of both the lipsticks are amazing I just swatched the inside one now i am swatching the studio west one now you can see I feel like there is no difference like literally if you see it very minutely maybe a little bit there is a difference but I honestly cannot see it when you swatch it on your lips like it looks exactly the same shade this is the studio west one and now I'm going to swatch the inside one on the other side of my lips and as I said I love both these lipsticks you can either have the inside one or the studio west one it does not matter so this is how the shade looks like after drying and maybe the inside one is a little bit more darker than the studio west one but honestly it does not matter because they are basically like the same shade and the long lasting power of both the lipsticks are also very very same like they are both long lasting and transfer proof as well so let's move into the third lipstick tube that I have and this is a newer favorite. Both these lipsticks are actually newer favorite. So this is the Plume lipstick in high tea and this is the ZM Isa. This is a lip cushion. Uh, actually I would like to say here that both the formulas of these lipsticks are very different. Although the shades are very similar, the formula of both the lipsticks are very different. The cushion lipstick is actually a little bit more satin like. It turns into a really nice matte finish uh, after a while but yeah it's a little bit more on the satin side so as you can see here these are the swatches of both the lipstick. I feel like the ZM side as you can see is a little bit more satin type but honestly once it, it takes a little bit time to dry down but once it dries down it forms a nice beautiful matte finish too so i feel like both the shades are very 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 similar they are cool toned nude lipsticks and i got both the shades in this month only and i absolutely love these type of shades although this looks a little bit washed out on me i love to pair them with a nice nude lip liner and i just love the shade a lot 
so the next we have here is the plum liquid lipstick and the ny bay lip crayon now both these formulas are very very different but i'll show you the shade this is exactly 100 percent spot on tube so the plum is a liquid lipstick and it's a beautiful cranberry shade the ny bay is a lip crayon that has a nice soft matte finish to it and as you can see just look at the shades they are exactly same and the uh, i actually love the nyb one really really because uh, it is extremely nice and very very comfortable on the lips and also the plum one is also comfortable it's um transfer proof actually the plum one the nyb one is not transfer proof but it is extremely comfortable more than the plum one i would say so as you can see also the plum one takes a little bit of time to dry down but once it dries down it looks exactly similar to the nyb one so this is how both the lipstick looks like side by side as you can see i really see no difference let me know if you guys see a difference but honestly i don't see a difference at all both these shades are beautiful nice cranberry shades that is perfect for the summer season also it depends on what type of lipstick you like if you like a more so liquid lipstick you can definitely go for the plum one but if you like a nice satin matte lipstick you can totally go for the nyb one as well and yeah i love both the shades so the next year we have the inside and cuffs and lashes both these actually have the similar type of formulation and this is the inside one i'm swatching and after that i will show you a swatch of the cuffs and lashes i feel like not only the shade is similar but also the formulation is a very 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 similar like they are super long lasting transfer proof and you know just like normal liquid lipsticks they are exactly the same and this is me swatching the cuffs and lashes one i love this shade a lot i need to wear more red toned lipsticks i know that so yeah this is the shade multiverse and this is the inside one obviously the inside one is a little bit much more cheaper i absolutely love the inside li liquid lipsticks i feel like they are comfortable also they're transfer proof now as you can see both these side by side i honestly see no difference at all both these are beautiful red toned liquid lipsticks that stay on for a really long time and both of them are transfer proof i i after swatching this lipstick i actually fell in love with both the shades so i will be wearing this more this summer because i feel like i need to you know i just need to use a little bit more color when it comes to lipsticks so yeah this is how both the shade looks like let me know which one was your favorite lipstick shade and yeah if you feel like there is a little bit difference you know in the lipsticks let me know about it too and yeah like that was it for the swatches so that was it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you guys uh, like the video and anyway do subscribe if you haven't yet and let me know which shade was your favorite shade so yeah and if you have any other lipstick shade that is quite unique and that i should check out let me know about it as well and i'll try to check it out anyway thank you so much for watching i love you guys a lot and i'll see you guys in my next one bye, -bye.